It's the hour of 7 o'clock on the morning program, and I want to welcome to the program Wayne Boyd, who's here. Good morning, Wayne. Good morning, Dave. How are you today? I'm fine. Get right into that microphone there so we can hear that nice voice. I'm going to reach over here and get my sheet here so we can, uh, you know, talk a little bit. Wayne is the uh, new owner. Well, when you say new owner, it's been about a year, right? Yeah, I've been there about a year. Yeah, uh, of the uh, Hackettstown Auto Sales and Hertz Rent-A-Car. And Wayne, you're located where? 115 East Plain Street. 115 East Plain, right. And uh, it, the business has been there for quite a while. Right? Oh, the business has been there, yes. Yeah, absolutely. You have, I understand, over five decades in the auto business. How did you first get interested in, in cars? Well, when I grew up, I was uh, the local car dealer there. A little used car lot had a needed a car wash kit, so I started washing cars. It was fun. I started washing cars and driving them around at nine. Did you really? Yeah, yeah. it was fun. You it, would drive the cars. Yeah, I would drive the cars around a lot. It was a lot of fun <laughs> That's driving. Great. <laughs> and I just got the bug from that, and then ever since I started painting cars, bodywork, and stuff like that, I just got. It. So that was really your interest, not in the mechanics necessarily. No, not the, the mechanics. repair and things, but no. the bodywork, yeah. Right, the bodywork part of it, and yeah. then I bought a junkyard in Whippany. And you I did, just, yes. And I sold wow. that, and now I'm doing this. Now, what was it like to be a junk dealer? Well, I had a lot of cars. I bought a lot of yeah. late model cars. We parted them out. Yeah, it was part right. of the business, and then we got out of that. And and I went to the car business again. I so you didn't do anything with the restorations? You know, they have these programs now, as you know, on, on uh, TV, uh, where they do these amazing restorations. Yes, yes. It's exciting. But oh, uh, it I really buy my is, cars. Yeah. I, I buy classic cars. I have a bunch of right. classic cars. You do? Yeah, oh, yeah. So what's your favorite? I have a 31 Ford five-window coupe. 31 Ford. Wow. Yeah, with a Hemi in it. With a Hemi? Yeah. But that's not the original. No, no, not no, the no original definitely engine. not. No, 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 no. <laughs> Were you responsible for putting that in there? No, the, I bought it like that. You did? Yeah. And I, wow. Yep, it's a nice car. Now, do you go to car auctions? Things I like go to that? car auctions every week, yep. Where's the most local one that uh, folks uh, are to? Mannheim. It's, uh, Mannheim? Yeah, on 46 and Fairfield. Okay. Mannheim yeah. Skyline. And they have pretty decent cars there? Yeah, it's, it's, it's an auction. you got to be careful what you buy. You do? Oh, yeah. yeah. So, so when you're buying something like that, how do you know what's good and what's not can is there a way to check it out i mean well we go through it yeah we go through it we check them out and then we bring them into the shop in the back motor city garage and okay. we let them go through the cars and yeah. then we put them out for sale these people there was a show that I was watching last week they bought a i think it was a very early camaro beautiful mm -hmm. car on the outside and they took a look inside and got underneath the, the uh, you know the rugs yeah. the whole thing was rusted Rust out, yes. the whole thing they had to spend fifty thousand dollars to get this thing restored. Yeah, you got to be careful what you buy. That's it. You know, that's that's it. That's why you want to buy a nice antique car. Go to Arizona. Is that right? Arizona, yeah. the place to buy that cars. That seems to be the place. Absolutely. The place. So let's talk a little bit about uh, Hackettstown Auto Sales now. You have now used cars. Used right? cars, yep. How do you select those? Are they selected for you or do you select No, we, we go out and we buy them. We purchase them. We go. We, we buy from Hertz. We get off rental cars. We can okay. sell them cars also. Okay. Uh, they have a plan, too. You can go online and buy a car from Hertz. You can. Yes. Yeah. You can rent a buy, I call it. But they could buy through you. They can also buy through me. Yeah. Yep. All right. We just started uh, financing, so we're going to buy here, pay here thing. So it's we just to get that off the road. So that would be fun to start. That's really terrific. It really is. And that's uh, great for folks to know. Now, when you select the used cars, mm -hmm. what do you look for? You look for a car that obviously is in great shape, right? Right. We check them out, go through the engines, the brakes, the front ends, make sure everything's good on them. Mm -hmm. The later model ones we try buying, you know, 09 right. and up, 09 07 on, and up. Yeah. yeah, see, just just to get a good car. Yeah, yeah and, and wanna... also ones with low mileage, I would assume. Well, low mileage, but tough today with low mileage. Because everything's around 100, 120, 130. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, yeah. who, who knows what you're going to get. But we go through it. We make sure we get a good product. Well, I have to tell you, the cars these days, I think, are capable of having higher mileages. For example, I just, uh, last year, turned in a 2008 Toyota Solera convertible. Right. I had over 350,000 miles on it and didn't even change the timing belt on it. That's, That's how amazing. long it lasted. Yeah, that, yeah, of course. You take care of the car. It takes care of you. Right. Absolutely. And uh, so, anyway, but, uh, you know, I mean, I, it was just amazing that I was mm -hmm. able to keep that that long and uh, able to, yeah. to uh, have that car uh, in decent shape as well. And we um, warranty all our cars, too. So You do? Yeah, okay. we warranty for inspection. Now, when you warranty them, when you buy them, are they warranty? No, no, okay. we're stuck with them. So you have to, yeah, we have to, to warranty the I car. I have to stand behind every car I sell. Now, how did you learn how to pick out cars? Years of experience. Like you get yeah. stuck with some lemons. And you have people that help you do that? or Yeah, or I have a mechanic shop in the back. Motor City yeah. Garage is our 
mechanic? That's I mean, really interesting that you're able to do that. So the cars that people buy from uh, Hackettstown Auto Sales, you warranty yourself, but you've also gone over those cars. So you have a reasonable and a very, very good uh, certainty that that car is a decent car. Oh, yeah. I, I'm, I'm, I'm standing behind it. It's, it's, it's guaranteed perfect. Okay. Um, you have, I understand you're just beginning to go on social media and, right. and marketing and so forth. Uh, how important do you think that is? Very important. I need to get my name out there. I need, I'm new in town. Yeah, you know, right. I'm new in town. I want to be out there. I want everybody to know that Absolutely. you can trust me. I'm here for you. All right. Very good. Um, okay. So that's terrific then. I mean, you, yeah. you know, you really have a really decent business going on. And uh, certainly one of the things that we can do is to help publicize, uh, publicize your business is to be on R&J, which you're doing right now. And so I want to encourage folks to, uh, to go on out and to contact you. How can they get in touch with you? Uh, you know, let's give the, all the information as to how they can contact Wayne Boyd. Well, they can contact me through my phone number. is 908-441-2666. And uh, you can call up any time you want during the day. We're there. We're there from like 8 o'clock in the morning till 5 o'clock. Saturdays were there from 9 o'clock till 2 o'clock. Wow. So you're, you're a busy guy. Yeah. Now, do you live locally? I live in Richfield Park. Well, you have a bit of a commute. Yeah, about 50 miles, 55 miles. Wow. How was the commute in today? Early the better. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, I, but what I'm saying is that you didn't experience too much ice. Or no, no, like no, no, no. The road's fine. Yeah, so wherever, right. Everything's wet. Just make sure you have windshield washer fluid. Yeah, right. Absolutely. It's a good day for it. Now, Wayne, let me ask you this. Do you repair cars also? Or? Our shop in the back does. You yeah, do? Motor City Garage, okay. yes. So under the warranty, if the person the has a problem, mm -hmm. you guys uh, have yep, a shop. Yep, bring it right in the back there. shop. Sasha will take care of you. And do you have any salespeople working for you as well, or are you doing no, the whole thing me, yourself? just me and uh, oh, the girl Danielle sits in the office too. With Renaissance her. man. I am, yes. You're, you're doing the whole deal here. We try. What's interesting to me is the fact that you've had so much experience in this, uh, and that certainly bodes well for those individuals who are coming in to see you. You have the experience. You can tell them, I would assume, that this is a good car. Yes, I do. But the thing is, you're a dealer, and everybody doesn't trust dealers. But like yeah. lawyers, yeah, I they think they get a bad taste in their mouth from you, and you try telling them that, you know, we're not here like that. When I'm here to sell you a good product. I want you to come back. I want you to tell your friends. Absolutely. And that's what, I, that's what I've been doing. If it's, that's why I'm doing it for so long. Yeah. Well, boy, you certainly have the experience. That's for sure. Uh, we are almost out of time, Wayne, unfortunately. Uh -huh. And it's really been interesting talking to you because I just love cars. So do and, I. Uh, and, you know, I mean, that's – and my, my nephew, from the time he was like six months old when he was first starting to talk – he was interested in cars, and now he's, he's out in California. He's racing. Oh, really? So, yeah. That's so great. He's, he's been involved in cars. It's, it's the kind of thing when you start it when you're young, you just stay with it, I think, your whole life. It's in right? your blood. Yeah, absolutely. It's in your blood. Absolutely. And the hot rods, too. That's why I, yeah. I added room to my garage so I can get five of them in there. So, so you have five. Now. I have five. I mean, you told me you had a couple, I, yeah, but I, I didn't have, realize you I had have five. five cars, yeah. Oh, wow. That's terrific. Wayne Boyd, owner of Hackettstown Auto Sales. And, Wayne, uh, your address once again so everybody yeah. knows. 115 East Plain Street. All right, and you have a telephone number they can call you? 908-441-2666. Let me ask you this. Do you recommend an appointment? Or no. can they just no. drop in and see Come you? on down. And you have cars the car. on the lot, right? Cars are on the lot, yep. Okay, very cool. If we don't have it, we can always find one for you. You can? Yep. Okay, so if a person comes in and says, hey, you know, I, I loved, I, cause I'm, I'm going to use me as an experience, I absolutely loved my Toyota, the convertible that yes. I had. I don't have a convertible anymore. So if I came into you and said, Wayne, I'm looking for a you know pretty decent uh, 2008 Toyota convertible, you might be able to find it for what me. What color? Red. What what <laughs> mileage in the area? Mileage. Well, I don't care. It's as long oh, as it's under 300,000. Yeah, right. <laughs> Absolutely. Right. Yeah, we can help you. No That's problem. That's great. Wow, yep. terrific. Well, as soon as I you know pay this one off, I'm gonna be in to see you. Okay. <laughs> Good. Thanks, Wayne. Thanks, Wayne Dave. Boyd, my guest here on Northwest Jersey's own RNJ. Wayne, best wishes and uh, much success with your Thank business. Thank you. I appreciate Thank it. Thank you. Wayne Boyd, my guest here on Northwest Jersey's own RNJ. 20 minutes past the hour, 7 o'clock. We'll be back in a moment. They say the best time to plant a tree is 20 years ago. The second best time is now. And in a way, the same can be said for home generators. Remember Superstorm Sandy? How it felt when the power went out? And you said next time you'd be ready? Well, now's the time to take the necessary steps so you will be ready, because there will be a next time. And the first step is to call to Frank Fontana at Get Wired 2, an electrical contractor who specializes in home generator installations. That means handling all the zoning issues, building...